Imagine if you could go back in time. I didn't really have a problem with school and my foster placement was all right. But the only one who ever really saw me was him. I'm not saying there weren't things in my life that I needed help with. Or that I wasn't a bit scared. But it's a life. A baby. And I knew more than anyone what she'd need. I've been thinking about it all my life. What I'd give for that, to be able to tell myself what was coming. When you've been in care, having a baby's like walking through a door. And on the other side, you're not a kid who can ask for help anymore. You're an unfit mum getting ready to do what's expected of you. To fail. First off, I tell her to forget about privacy. She'd know that her whole life's going to be on display. That she'll be judged for things in her past that were never her fault. I'd explain that the people deciding if she's fit to be a mum are housing officers, midwives, health visitors. Everyone gets to vote. And that whatever's thrown at her, however far-fetched, that she must keep focus and somehow not take the most personal thing in the world personally. Then I'd help her be ready for the tests. Tests she has to pass. But also, take control of. Where she gets what she needs, not just accepts what she's given. And there'll be times where she thinks she's made it. But she mustn't rest. Not yet. I tell her she's got to keep going. Remind her that it's the process that makes it so hard, not the people. And that whatever's going on in her life, that nothing else matters anymore. It's now or never. But more than any of this, I tell her she mustn't try and do it alone. I can't go back and help me. Maybe I can help you.